Hello everyone. Today we're going to take a quick walk around look at this very nice and very well equipped 2015 Dodge Durango RT Blacktop Edition. And this Durango RT is in red lined red tri-coat. Has the black premium Napa perforated leather interior. And this vehicle is all wheel drive. It is powered by a 5.7 liter Hemi MDS V8 engine. Has the 8 speed 8 HP 70 automatic transmission with manual shiftability. As you can see, it does have the iconic racetrack LED tail lamps. It does have the park sensor, rear parking sensors as well as the park view backup camera which activates in reverse and has active guidance lines unique to the blacktop is the gloss black durango and rt badges And this vehicle does have 20 inch black painted aluminum wheels on Goodyear Forterra HL tires. They measure 265.50 R20. This vehicle does have a power sunroof. The black side caps on the side view mirrors and the side view mirrors also have LED turn repeaters. Up front, Xenon projector beam HID headlamps with blacked out bezels and LED daytime running lights. We've also got the gloss black grille, projector beam fog lamps. This vehicle is also equipped with the adaptive cruise control, blind spot monitoring with cross path detection. All right, and this vehicle is equipped with the remote start. To operate is easy, just double press the remote start button on the key fob. And using keyless enter and go smart key access is easy just by keeping the key fob in your purse or pocket. To lock the vehicle, simply locate the black button on the door handle. The door will lock. To unlock, simply grab the handles you'd open it. And inside, we have power heated automatic dimming rear view mirrors, power windows and power door locks, red accent stitching as well as satin silver brushed aluminum trim, two driver memory, eight way power driver and passenger seat with four way adjustable lumbar support, perforated Napa leather interior with red accent stitching, the red RT logo, plus your automatic headlamp control with fog lamp, panel dim, remote fuel door release, perforated leather, tilt and telescoping steering column with audio controls and shift paddles. All right, pan through the interior, just show a little more detail. Satin silver trim on the steering wheel as well as the chrome around the horn button. You have your reconfigurable instrument cluster display controls. You connect Bluetooth controls as well as your cruise control and adaptive cruise controls. Zinc plated paddle shifters, left side for downshift, right side for upshift. Does have the reconfigurable cluster display. Vehicle currently has 5,510 miles on it. Moving down, 8.4 inch touchscreen display with Sirius XM satellite radio. You've also got your Uconnect media. Controls for heated seats, ventilated seats, and heated steering wheel. You've also got your headrest dump, automatic dimming rear view mirror. Controls for your dual zone climate control. Garmin base navigation system phone controls, and of course your Uconnect apps. 
with Sirius XM Travel Link, your Wi-Fi hotspot, and your settings. Moving down below, you have redundant controls for audio and climate controls. Your ParkSense parking sensor power switch. Your forward collision warning, eco mode, and stability control. And moving down, you connect inputs for auxiliary input, USB port, and SD card reader. You also have a 12-volt power point. Illuminated front cup holders, your rotary e-shift, transfer case selector, and your center armrest. You do have your single disc CD player with Blu-ray disc uh, readability, 12-volt power point, and some storage. All right, and overhead, overhead LED reading lights, as well as your map lights, rear liftgate control, ambient lighting, sunroof control, and home link universal garage door opener. We also got integrated sunglasses holder, automatic dimming rearview mirror with Uconnect Assist and 911 dial, illuminated vanity mirrors, and sliding visors. All right, look at the middle row seat. The seat. This vehicle does have three rows of seats. Rear doors, the uh, red trim continues as well as the satin silver trim. This particular vehicle has the uh, twin captain chairs, fully adjustable, has the red accent stitching, and the perforated leather as well as the RT logo. Full center console with stitched armrest and storage. You've also got a USB charge port and a 12 volt power point upper level storage, illuminated cup holders in the storage tray, and rear seat passengers also have their own positional air vents, panel distribution, twin USB charge ports, heated seat controls, and a 115 volt, 150 watt AC outlet. Overhead, you have your rear climate control, lighting and vents. Another nice feature, you have the dual DVD rear entertainment system. And on each seat, you have your HDMI inputs and AV inputs. And folding the seat is easy. Just lifting up on the lever at the base of the seat and pulling the red strap to pull forward. Gains access to the third row seat. Third row seat seats two across. 50-50 split folding seat, does also have the perforated leather, red accent stitching, and third row seat also has our own positional reading lights and air vents. All right, take a quick look at the luggage area. With the third row seat up, it is modest. However, it is a nice load flat floor. And you do have extra storage in the underneath, as well as your jack stowage, and your Alpine and subwoofer and amplifier. 
lift gate close switch. You've also got your rechargeable torch that plugs into your trim panel. Storage. We're uh, privacy shade. Folding the seats is easy though, however, just to fold them, you lift up on this handle here. And your privacy screen can actually be moved forward as well, which is nice. And to close the lift gate, just simply press the lift gate button on the trim panel. All right, this just can clear a quick walk around. Look at this 2015 Dodge Durango RT Blacktop Edition. If you have any questions or like to see this vehicle, please contact our showroom. One of our friendly sales staff will be more than happy to answer any questions that you may have. And as always, thanks for watching.